I had a patient recently switch GLP-1 medications and their food noise came roaring back and they didn't understand why this happened. I wanna see if this has happened to you. So this patient was on Wegovy 2.4 milligrams. They were doing pretty well, but their GI side effects were just really not what they wanted them to be. So they request to switch over to terzepatide. When they switched over to terzepatide, they went from 2.4 milligrams of Wegovy over to 2.5 milligrams of terzepatide. Now in their head, that was a pretty even trade, 2.4 of one, 2.5 of the other. But within about a week, their food noise came back and it came back strong and they didn't understand why. So they reached out to me and this is what I told them. So those numbers look really similar, 2.4, 2.5, but Wegovy is semaglutide and Zetbound is terzepatide. These are two totally different medications and they each have their own scale. That scale is not interchangeable. So 2.4 milligrams of Wegovy or semaglutide is actually your highest possible dose. While 2.5 milligrams of terzepatide is actually your lowest possible dose. When you switch between GLP-1s, the idea is not really to match your current dose. You're kind of starting over fresh. And we really do that just to try to help minimize some of the side effects. Because terzepatide actually works on two receptors and not one receptor, you may not need a super high dose of terzepatide. So if we took you from a super high dose of semaglutide, put you on a super high dose of terzepatide, we might not know that it, you may not need all that. So generally we always start you back at the beginning, put you on the low dose and then work your way up. But milligrams of one and milligrams of the other are not the same. It is like comparing apples and oranges. This happens a lot in my office with other medications like blood pressure meds and things. People think if I give them 100 milligrams of one blood pressure medicine and 25 milligrams of another, that automatically the 100 milligrams is a much stronger medication. And that's not always true. Again, each medication has its own scale. So if you are confused, always check with your prescriber. If something doesn't seem right, always check in before you take your dose. I wanna hear down in the comments section, what are you currently taking and what is your dose? And I want you to hit that follow button right here if you are currently on one GLP-1 and you think it might be time to switch.